God said to Abraham, Go to yourself. Know yourself. Fulfill yourself. This verse is addressed to every person. Search and discover the root of your soul so that you can fulfill it and restore it to its source, its essence. The more you fulfill yourself, the closer you approach your authentic self. Thought is like a mirror. One looking at it sees his image inside and thinks that there are two images. But the two are really one. When you train yourself to hear the voice of God in everything, you attain the quintessence of the human spirit. Usually, the mind conceals the divine thoroughly by imagining that there is a separate mental power that constructs the mental images. But by training yourself to hear the voice of God in everything, the voice reveals itself to your mind as well. Then, right in the mind, you discover revelation. Whatever one implants firmly in the mind becomes the essential thing. So if you pray and offer a blessing to God, or if you wish your intention to be true, imagine that you are light. All around you, in every corner and on every side, is light. Turn to your right and you will find shining light. To your left, splendor, a radiant light. Between them, up above, the light of the presence. Surrounding that, the light of life. Above it all, a crown of light, crowning the aspirations of thought, illuminating the paths of imagination, spreading the radiance of vision. This light is unfathomable and endless. The soul will cleave to the divine mind, and the divine mind will cleave to her. For more than the calf wants to suck, the cow wants to suck. She and the Divine Mind become one, like pouring a jug of water into a gushing spring, all becomes one. <laughs>